What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Young Dub. Coming at y'all with another video here. I uh, got another update for the channel. I know y'all seeing double right now, man. Um, did a video a couple days ago saying um, I had, uh, well, I had unboxed one of these uh, Pioneers uh, GM8604. Told you I had another one on the way. Uh, she got here. I think she actually came yesterday, man. I can't remember, but um, either way, I got the amp here. So, yes, you are seeing double, man. I got, um, got the second Pioneer GMD 8604 for a channel amp in today or yesterday. Uh, so, I guess I'll kind of do an unboxing of this just to show uh, that we got two of them. Uh, like I said, man, we we're going to run uh, one Hellify setup this year when it comes to... Um, the highs and um, bass will be coming soon. Uh, obviously, you know, if I'm doing all of these speakers, I plan on running something crazy for the bass. So uh, that'll be coming up next. But I'm just going to uh, honestly do an unboxing on this because um, the previous video, I did an unboxing on this amplifier amplifier here. And um, all the, uh, well, everything was packed away like it was supposed to be except for the mounting screws. Uh, they were just rolling around in the box. Uh, like I said, both of these are brand new. Uh, this one's brand new. This is from another video. This one's brand new as well. So let me just uh, do an unboxing on this just to see how uh, she came packaged compared to the last one. Uh, like I said, ran, ran one of these last summer. Was that last summer? Yeah. Ran one of these last summer on the uh, rear deck of my Impala uh, with the four 8-inch four eight inch Rockville pro speakers that I had in there was very pleased with it obviously I was pleased with it if I was you know if I'm gonna take a chance on uh, running two more of these two years ago I had with the other white Impala I had um, I had the 1200 watt there was the 9601 I think it was a 1200 watt version of it and the 8601 for the um, uh, 800 watts RMS version of that so there you go unboxing of the pioneer hopefully y'all can see that i'll lean it down a little bit there so same deal comes with all the stuff your um owner's manual operation manual whichever way you want to look at it comes with the um, high low adapters just in case you plan on running that uh with your factory deck so there's that for you there's the amplifier let me not make let me make sure the other one don't fall you get her out of here all right so here we go again. Brand new. This one is missing the mounting hardware. Pioneer, what are y'all doing, man? What's going on with this right now? So here's the plastic. Um, let me see what's going on. So this, all right, so what's going on with this? I've been ordering these brand new from Sonic Electronics. Um, this one here I got from Sonic Electronics last week. Brand new. Uh, they had a like, 4th of July sale, so I used that code to get a discount on this one. This one had the mounting hardware taped to the bottom of the box like this one should have, but y'all can see it's nothing in there. Um, but the mounting screws were just rolling around in this box. This one has a hole in the plastic well i'm not tripping about that i don't care about i might care hold on let me open this honestly this should be brand new i think this is a refurb because she don't have this thing don't have the plastic all these pioneers come with the plastic on this and this thing i think this has been used Yeah, I'm not. I hopefully, let me stay in front of the camera. I'm not sure about this. Yeah, yeah, there's no way in hell this thing has been used. Look at the bottom of this. Yeah, Sonic, we got a problem here. March 2018. I don't know, man. But I, if it's brand new, it shouldn't have that stuff on the bottom of there. It should come with all the stuff mounted. So, yeah, we gonna, I'm going to have to hit up Sonic Electronics. Like, yo, man, this, there's no way in the world this is a brand new amp because... It should have the, um, it's got smudges on it. Yeah, this is this is a used amp. So we're going to uh, 
I wanted to do an unboxing video just to compare how they were packed compared to the other one. But yeah, so clearly this this um this is you, so that's gonna put a little bit of a halt in the plans because this is going back. There's I'm not about to pay for brand new amps if I'm about to get used products. So this is the first um dissatisfied experience that i've had with sonic electronics man but this so this is used but we'll move on from that because the purpose of this video actually wasn't for the pioneer amp it was for the purpose of these and these came packed pretty damn crappy but y'all can see that these are my prv uh six and a half uh six mb 200s this is literally how they came packed um just two of these was taped here with the eBay tape. Hopefully y'all can see that. And kind of like Scar did with there, they just packed in the paper, man. But that 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 uh, Pioneer thing just really pissed me off. But whatever, we'll move along. So happy to have these. Uh, y'all see these? I've been talking about these for a minute. These are my PRV Audio uh, 6.5 inch 8 on mid bass speakers. Uh, you can see the sticker right there. I did cut the top open just to make it easier for the video, so let's get these jokers out of here, man. So, when you open the speaker up, you'll get the little sticker here. I'm probably not going to use that. I don't think that's just a regular sticker. It's not vinyl or anything like that. Uh, you'll get your... I believe this is the warranty uh, card here, or registration card. So, this tell you about the product. But let's get to that speaker. Protective layer on top. Speaker in plastic here. And let's get her open. So there she is. So this this has a this has definitely has a different material compared to the scar speaker that I got. Uh, the FXX uh, 65s or 6.5 inch 8 ohm speakers. This has, I don't know if this is like, um, as far as I know, these are not uh, a marine grade speaker. It's got the accordion cloth, but it's, I don't know, it's got like a different texture. So that's pretty uh, unique right there. It's pretty neat. Kind of kind of similar to the SCAR speakers. You got your yellow spider, stem steel basket. It's regular as hookups on there. So, y'all get you solder those on or put the butt connectors on it. Uh, let's get the magnet, ferret magnet. So, same deal. It is vented as well. So, she's got some cooling on her. Um, 100 watts RMS. And I did hit PRV. If y'all can see, I don't know if that, try to get the flash off of it. There she goes. So, y'all can see that right there. It says 200 watts uh, program power. So I did hit PRV up on Facebook like, yo, what's the deal with the 100 watts RMS uh, right here and then the 200 watts program power. What they were saying um, was to make sure that your amp that you put to like the one speaker here would be 200 watts because, you know, with your voltage drop. And I don't know what's the deal. You know, like, I guess you could technically still have a bit of impedance rise on these. So they were saying make sure that your amp is 200 watts. Uh, to make sure that the, the speaker itself is actually seeing 100 watts RMS. So if you guys are looking at ordering these speakers and you see that uh, 100 watts RMS down there, and then you see the 200 watts uh, program power, uh, that was their explanation to me. So if you're interested in ordering these, uh, I'll, I'll have a review sooner or later. Uh, due to the fact y'all just seen my amp was used and we're not going to roll with that. So um We'll get these up and going pretty soon. I'll do a review on them. You guys can hit me up. And um, just like every other video, any questions, comments, concerns, I will definitely hit you up. Uh, definitely respond to you, man. But I'm going to get these. I'm going to open just another one in there. Y'all can see it. Uh, hopefully. Yeah, I guess it's, I thought it was a white box. Just trying to make after the Pioneer issue, I'm trying to make sure everything's spread away. So uh, I'll get on that. I'm going to go ahead and email Sonic Electronics right now and tell them. Y'all send me a use amp, man. So it's your boy Young Dub. Yeah, it, uh, like I said, any questions, comments, concern, hit me up. I'm out.